Hola, en este video analizaremos una pequeña discusión entre una pareja de recién casados. ¿De qué discuten? Veamos. Well, if I'm so bad, then why do you want to live with me? Because you're my husband and I'm your wife and you better get used to it. Where are you going? To get used to it. Well, pick up a new attitude while you're at it. I will. Well, if I'm so bad, then why do you want to live with me? Él pregunta, well, if I'm so bad, then why do you want to live with me? Well, being o pues, if I'm so bad, si soy tan malo, then, entonces, why do you want to live with me? ¿Por qué quieres vivir conmigo? Well, if I'm so bad, then why do you want to live with me? Because you're my husband and I'm your wife. Because you're my husband and I'm your wife. Because you're my husband and I'm your wife. Porque tú eres mi esposo y yo soy tu esposa. En inglés podemos usar why para preguntar por qué y because para responder por qué. Why do you want to live with me? ¿Por qué quieres vivir conmigo? Because you're my husband and I'm your wife. Because you're my husband and I'm your wife. Porque tú eres mi esposo y yo soy tu esposa. No confundan la palabra your con la palabra your. Suenan y se escriben casi igual, pero significan algo diferente. Your es la contracción de la frase you are, que significa tú eres, como en you are my husband, you're my husband, tú eres mi esposo. Y your es una forma posesiva como en I'm your wife, I'm your wife, yo soy tu esposa. Because you're my husband and I'm your wife, and you better get used to it. And you better get used to it. And you better get used to it. Y más vale que te vayas acostumbrando. Cuando vean la frase you had better o you'd better en una oración, considérenlo un consejo o una pequeña amenaza. To get used to significa acostumbrarse a algo como en I have to get used to my new job. I have to get used to my new job. Tengo que acostumbrarme a mi nuevo trabajo. Where are you going? To get used to it. Ella pregunta, where are you going? Where are you going? ¿A dónde estás yendo? Y él dice, to get used to it. To get used to it. A acostumbrarme. Well, pick up a new attitude while you're at it. Yeah, I will. Well, pick up a new attitude while you're at it. Well, pick up a new attitude while you're at it. Literalmente significa, bueno, recoge una nueva actitud mientras estés en eso. Pick up es un verbo compuesto. Significa recoger, levantar o pasar a buscar. Well, if I'm so bad, then why do you want to live with me? Because you're my husband and I'm your wife and you better get used to it. Where are you going? To get used to it. Well, pick up a new attitude while you're at it. I will.